What's up guys, this is JK Aviation 24 here coming at you with airport update number one for New York LaGuardia International or I think regional, I don't know. It seems like a regional to me, but um anyway guys, so in this airport update I am gonna I do have a lot of aircraft here. Um any routes that I have that are any routes that I had for the other airport are gonna be transferred here as well. Just like for Tokyo, all routes are shared, so Yep, the only planes you won't see here are, um, super heavy, like, heavy planes. The only heaviest they have is the 7.6 and the 7.57-200, so, um, let's get started. So, Terminal 1, and I outlined where the terminal's gonna be with a gold sharpie, so I can yeah, park. Yeah, so this is the futuristic design of Gogwadia. Yeah, this is the futuristic design, because they are upgrading, and there is construction going on over there, so... Eventually, in the future, we'll see it like this. So, anyway, right here we got the JetBlue AC-21 in the Prism's tail. He's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to, um, um, Miami. Right here we got the JetBlue AC-21 high-rise tail. This guy's going to be heading out to? He could be. I mean, AC-20, not AC-21. He's going to be heading out to? He could be heading out to Kingston, Jamaica. Right here we got the JetBlue AC-20 <clears throat> with sharklets. This guy's going to be heading out to Boston. Right here we got a Southwest 737-700 in the Triple Crown. This guy's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to um, Fort Myers. Oh, and also guys, um, before I continue on with the rest of the aircraft, uh, this airport is not going to remain like this with the paper showing. I am going to paint it over and add some more grass so it looks way better. Just, just under construction, but I wanted to do an airport update for it, because I never got to do one yet for it, and I'm pretty sure it would take a long time before I release an airport update for this when it's fully constructed. So, yeah. Anyway, continuing to the regional side, as you can see, the terminal curves all the way down here. So we got a Delta CRJ, I mean, yeah, CRJ 200. Um, Delta Connections, this guy's going to be heading out to? He could be heading out to um, a quick hop to New York John Kennedy, which I do find them doing that sometimes. Right here we got an American Eagle Q100, this guy's going to be heading out to? He could be heading out to Philly, Tokyo. Right here we got a United Express Q400, this guy's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to... Um, Phoenix Sky Harbor. Right here we got a WestJet Q400. This guy is pulling into the gate from? He's pulling into the gate from Calgary. Right here we got a Delta Connections um, E145. This guy is going to be pushing back for? He's going to be pushing back to um, Albany, um, Providence. Right here we got a Delta Connection SAP 340. He's gonna be heading out to. He's gonna be heading out to Albany, New York. New York. Also, I forgot about the hard stand right here. So we got a United on um, 737 900 ER in the Eco Skies livery. He's gonna be heading out to Southwest. I mean, um, Northern Virginia International or Southwest 252's airport. Mm -hmm. Actually, I should put him right here. Just a little squeeze. Hey, Ben Ben. As you can see, my dog is right there. He's been, he's just, he's just watching us. All right, guys. So we're going to continue on. This is kind of like the, I'm going to make this kind of the Southwest, kind of the Southwest JetBlue United Terminal. And then this is the regional stands for all small aircraft. And then over here is going to be the American and Delta terminal. So, right here we got an American Airlines 737-800 um, in the Reno Heritage. This guy's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to um, Nassau, Bahamas. Next to him we have an American 737-800 in the One World. He's going to be heading out to? He's going to be heading out to, um, um, 
Seattle. Next to him, we got a Delta um, 737 800. This guy's going to be heading out to Harbor City International or JJW Aviations Airport. And right here, we got a CRJ 900 Delta Connections. This guy's going to be heading out to Portland, Maine. Now, on to the taxiing aircraft, arrivals, and some departing. So we have a Delta 737-900 ER. He landed a while in, well, he's taxiing. He taxied off the runway, but he came in from? He came in from, um, um, um San Diego. We got an American um, A321-200S. This guy is pulling, pulled off the runway from his flight to... Dallas-Fort We got a Delta um, A321-200S. This guy is pushing on the brakes, I guess. You could say... Well, he's like slowing down. Yeah, he's slowing down from his land. He landed from... He landed in from Atlanta. Down here, um, jetting down the runway, we have a Virgin America A321 Neo. This guy's going to be heading out too. He's going to be heading out to Northern Virginia. The Maybe national sure. itself was to Baptist Airport, and, and he came in earlier from um, Los Angeles. Right here we got a United 767-300ER. Um, I don't know if this still comes here or not, if United sends it at all, or if it's just all light aircraft now. But uh, you can let me know in the comment section down below. And also, guys, if you want routes, let me know. And I will um, gladly gladly give you routes. Um, I said this in the last video. Each aircraft, I'll put twenty routes on. So, and I'll just flip flop. I'll just flip flop from time to time. So, um, this United seven six seven, um, three hundred is going to be. He's taxiing to the runway to head out to. Uh, he's gonna be heading out to um, Honolulu. Right here we got a Delta 757, let me get you a better shot, there we go. We got a Delta 757-200, this guy is waiting for um, Virgin America to take off, to head out to. He's going to be heading out to Chaco Domin Dominican Republic. Anyway guys, so that concludes for this airport update. Um... This one was actually kind of more lengthier than the Tokyo Narita airport update. But um, also, guys, let me know if you want routes with any of the planes for my airports. And my yeah, mascot. let you know. Huh? Thank you to my mascot for my channel. Yeah, there's my dog. There he is. Benji, say hello. He's looking at the camera. He's a mascot for my channel. Yeah, go subscri subscribe to my brother's channel named Benji Fun. Um, he, Joel does different videos. My brother does different videos on there. Like, I, I don't know. I don't know. Benji's mascot vlogs. Yeah, he does stuff with the dog, so go check it out, guys. Um, Definitely support him. He's got uh 28 subscribers. And I have barely any views on my. Yeah, he has barely any view, guys. Views, guys, go check, go check him out. Give him a like, make him happy. And um, anyway, guys, as I was saying, if you want roots for this airport, let me know in the comment section down below as well. And um, subscribe to my channel if you didn't. We're almost at a hundred subscribers, guys. We have eighty-five now, or eighty-six. I don't even know now because um, I was just in a chat and people were trading subscribers, so I was subscribing to them too. We were like all subscribing to each other, so. I don't even know how many subscribers I have now. I didn't check yet, but I will, so, yeah, I don't know. I'm somewhere close to 100 right now, so if we can do that, that would be amazing. I may do a giveaway. I have that Hertz to give away my 1 to 400 skill Hertz building. I am going to be giving that away, so, um, yeah, if you guys want it, let me know. Um, I'll probably, I don't know, pick at random. I'll pick at random who gets the Hertz building. You just got to comment on that video 
for the 100 subscribers. And that concludes for this video, and I'll see you guys again next time.